Good morning. Welcome to Beach Art Journal. A beachy art journal. Okay, I'm going to give this Jane Davenport mat a really bad review. <laughs> it is so incredibly sticky, which I guess is good if you don't want things to slide around. But if you do want things to slide around, forget it. Forget it. Okay. I have it on top, my project on top of a wrapper from some product because otherwise it just sticks. Am I complaining already? Ay, ay, ay. Okay. Yeah, I am. All right. We have company. Um, my husband is downstairs. Nobody is awake yet except for him, and he's moving furniture. Um, and he won't listen to me to do it when we're, after everybody gets up. So I just decided that I need to make a video. I'm going to get out of his way and leave him alone because he's not listening anyhow. Oh, am I complaining again? Ay, ay, ay. Okay. I am. It's a gorgeous morning here. It's cool for sure. Much cooler than it has been, but it's clear. Okay, so Beach Art Journal. What is Beach Art Journal about? It's uh, the month of January where I made up some prompts that belong at a beach. And because I'm here, I decided to use this as a topic. And I do better with prompts if you don't already know. Um, I do much better with prompts. If I'm left to my own devices, it, it falls apart. I don't do the ladies and I don't do mermaids. That's just not my style. They're beautiful, but it's not my style. Um, so I came, I said, well, why don't I do some beachy stuff? I'm like, okay, that's what I'll do. I thought I got this book at a overstock store for like a dollar 49, I think it was. And yes, I have a cinch at home, but it's at home, which is three hours away. And I'm not going to for another week. Well, it's five or six days. So we'll see how long this lasts. Um, but uh, I haven't done the cover and I've left a couple pages blank because a lot of times I'll put like the pump sheet here and I haven't printed it out yet. So all I've done is paint this with white paint, craft paint. I thought this could be the cover, but it needs to be configured a little differently so it incorporates the spine. So that's a possibility, but not right now. So the first prompt is sea oats. Now sea oats are gorgeous. They are uh, protected here tremendously. Um, you're not allowed to walk anywhere, but they're all the, also the first thing to go in a hurricane. Which, by the way, Carty, I s have not been able to find what happened to your family's place. So I hope they're okay. Um, and they're they're like a grass. They're beautiful. Uh, if you're from the West Coast, I don't know if it's anywhere else. I grew up with it. Rattlesnake grass, which the little tip of the grass looks like a rattlesnake tail. I haven't thought about that in years. Okay. Um, it's a little bit like that. It's more, it looks like wheat. It looks like wheat, but it's, I don't know how long wheat grows, how tall it gets. Anyhow, it's very pretty and, um, it's highly protected. It allows the dunes to not fall apart, DK. Can you see my cookies? Oh, good, okay. I have a lot of Christmas stuff, food, snack bits hanging around, and our friends brought three times as much, so this is a house full of snacks. Oh dear, I just complained again, oh dear. Okay, sea oats. So, I have this piece of paper. I don't know what I'm going to do. But I kind of like maybe starting with this. That works so far. And I just painted the pages white, and I probably will, to give me a clean slate. Some of them, I might incorporate the picture that's on it. 
Ooh, my new book. I wonder if it has um, sea oats in it. My gardening book or something like it. I got this at an overstock store too. Let's see if they have an index. Grasses. seaweed. I'm going to look for something that looks like sea oats. So we're getting some good ideas. My, our, The wife of our, the couple that are here, our friends, um, she's a good decorator and I like her vibe. Um, so she's helping me move things around and maybe add this to that and remove that and let's add color to that. She's good at that kind of stuff. She can see things that I can't see that aren't there yet. Vision. She has good vision. Decorating vision. And um, so we're going to play with that and moving some this, <clears throat> and then the girls are playing of course. Ah. It's not unlike something like that. Mexican feather grass. All right, let's put a piece of paper there for a second. That's pretty, but that's not, it's too green. It's more of a dry looking plant, even though it's alive. Not quite that furry. There's a ton of old VCR stuff, um, stereo stuff, things that just you don't have the technology for anymore. And it's heavy stuff, heavy equipment. There was, I think, three DVD players. <laughs> And one had um, like a possibility that you could play or have seven or eight DVDs lined up, like music ones, and then they would play. I mean, he had they had good stuff. They, nothing was cheap. It was all good quality. The guy that owned this house was a semi-professional golfer. So, I mean, he was not lacking in funds, and he, um, they didn't skimp on price of anything. It's good quality stuff, so it's lasted a long time, but nobody uses DVD players anymore. All right, I think to keep the vibe the grass even though that there's a flower right there but it needs more something here how could I do this maybe just like that okay there we go Flower gone. Kapoof. Isn't this color gorgeous? Metallic cobalt blue. That's this color. metallics but they're pretty so I'm okay with it oh that's a lot
Now, yellow. You know how I feel about yellow. I think yellow helps everything. I love the pop of yellow, but I'm gonna water it down. Let's do a little bit of black, maybe. Leafy grass. So yeah, I thought it would just be fun to do some kind of prompt list for January to keep me focused and remind me of this amazing adventure we're on here. And it doesn't have to be fancy. It doesn't have to be anything. I'll try to remember to post things to Instagram. <laughs> And if you want to play along, put your picture on Instagram. I made up a hashtag. What did I call it? Beach Art Journal. Hashtag Beach Art Journal, I think. I'm gonna, I have it in the title stuff. I think. That might be it. It's kind of plain. Maybe I'll cover this tag off of a zipper pouch and just kind of, okay, here's another thing I'm going to do for the time being. I'm going to add the prompt name by having it hang loose because we're hanging loose, we're hanging loose for this prompt list. We're hanging loose, people. That means I need to find some cord or something. Hmm, didn't think that through all the way. That's okay. I have this light I'm trying to use as a light box to cut this with. It's 
some cord. This came off of something. Hmm. Maybe if I split this. Oh dear. Oh, there we go. It was three ply. Hmm. Oh, this whole punch is terrible. Just because they're sitting right here. Hmm. I think I'm going to add some washi tape. No. Nah. Okay, see you. Luckily, this one's small. Let's see? Hmm. I do like these. Except that you can't see what you're doing. That's why I love acrylic. We'll just make a singular oat. tape because I gotta tape it down. Let's see, let's use this one. This gold metallic one. Pretty metallic. See out. We need an edge, don't we? I don't know why I like doing this, but I do. A frame. Something in me that likes a frame. up in the attic of this house there's tons of stuff up there we found several more lamps we found another Keurig coffee pot thing we found um, a whole basket of beach towels that look brand new and I'll wash them and everything but these people had a ton of stuff okay Hear little voices. Time to end my adventure for today. Oh, I really like that. See you. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow with another prompt.